Ah, ce que vous aviez en tête, ce que vous pensiez, ce que vous avez dans le cœur. Et c'est ça que je voulais savoir. Le Premier ministre vous a répondu sur les choses que le gouvernement a fait ou va faire. Mais sur ce que le gouvernement va faire, il faut que le Premier ministre et ses ministres sachent bien que nous, vous et moi, nous allons. Je suis venu vous dire qu'il faut bien regarder et qu'il faut qu'il fasse les choses que vous avez demandées. Parce que si ce n'est pas fait, il faut me dire, pour les femmes, tout à l'heure, les AGR, c'est 2 milliards. Pour, pour les hommes d'affaires, c'est 7 milliards. Ça fait 9 milliards. Et de plus, j'ai voulu que la population ait l'habitude de travailler ensemble, toute la population. Alors, j'ai créé le conseil provincial qui regroupe tous les élus de la province, hein, municipaux, départementaux. Ils vont se retrouver au... Gabon will hold the presidential legislature and local elections on August 26th, the country's government announced Tuesday. The Council of Ministers announced the convening of the Electoral College for the election of the President of the Republic plus members of the National Assembly and Municipal Councils in August. While President Ali Bongo Odimba has not yet said whether he will stand again, he is widely expected to run for re-election against a very divided opposition. Bongo's powerful Gabonese Democratic Party PDG holds strong majorities in both houses of parliament and is pushing for the president to announce he will run again. Bongo came to power in 2009 when he took over from his father, Omal Bongo Odimba, and was narrowly re-elected in 2016. A stroke in 2018 kept him on the sidelines of politics for months as he recovered. His mobility is still somewhat reduced yet. In recent months, the president has increased tours of the country and has participated in various international summits and official visits ahead. The Bongo family has ruled the country for 55 years already, with the opposition gradually branding them a dynastic power, a divided opposition. So far, however, uh, the opposition has failed to agree on a single candidate for the presidential election, with between 15 to 20 candidates having announced their intention to run. Amongst those on the opposition is Alexandre Balo Chambria from the Ara, Ara PM party, one of the residency strong critics. He has yet to announce his intentions of running. Another important opposition figure is the Paulette Misambo, president of the Union Nationale, UN, who has announced her candidature for the Alternance 2023 coalition. Gabon is one of the richest African countries in terms of GDP due to its petrol, timber, and manganese production, as well as its low population at only 2.3 million people. It is amongst the top producers of petroleum in sub-Saharan Africa, with the resource accounting for 38.5% uh, of its GDP and 70.5% of its export revenue. Thank you so much for watching.